Hello guys, handbag workout, what is all that about? Here's what happened. We were sitting around the office the other day and we got a lot of girls who work with us and we were saying, what on earth do you have in that bag? I picked it up, it felt like it weighed a ton. So we had a bit of a weigh-in and the heaviest handbag in the Feel Fit office was weighing in a stonking seven kilos. Now in old money, that's one stone. Can you believe you're carrying that round on your shoulder all day? But I thought to myself, rather than that being a negative, how about we turn it into a bit of a positive? So we've come up with some great little, very cheesy exercises that you can do at home. So never again will there be an excuse for you to say, I haven't got any equipment, because we're gonna turn this into a kettlebell, or a dumbbell, or a piece of resistance equipment that's gonna do some good for that upper body. I don't carry a handbag, so I'm gonna get out of this one now and leave you in the capable hands of Jackie. Have fun. Are you ready? So grab your handbags. We're gonna start with a, um, a front raise. So we're gonna focus on working our shoulders. Pick your heel up, bring your arms in front. You're gonna lift. I wanna still see those smiles over those hands and then release. Good, and then lift. Now you will truly feel the real weight of your handbag and relax. And again, lift. We're going to do 10 on this leg and then we're going to change over just so you're nice and balanced. So when you're ready, lift it up nice and tall. Abdominals pulled in. Get your neck and shoulders nice and relaxed. We're going to change over to the other side now. It gives you 10 left. Feet hip width. Pick up your heel and off you go. You've got 10. So how many of you now are thinking you want to clean out your handbags? A few of you, you've got six more left. Are you ready? Six. Five. Four, keep that posture nice and tall. Three, two more to go. Last one. And you should definitely have felt that through your shoulders. We're going to move on now, working the bottom and thighs. So I'd like you to reach through. You're going to reach through, pull up, and take it back down again. Move it through and relax. So shoulder height and release. Squat all the way down. How you doing? We okay? Just be careful of the sofa. Maybe the cat if it's sat on top of the sofa. You've got six more. Five, four, three, you're nearly there. Two, and one. Whew. Arms and legs are getting worked there. We're now gonna move on to the back of the arm, the old bingo wings. I'd like you to take the bag over the head. I'm just gonna show you slightly from the side. You're gonna keep the elbows pointing forward, take it behind your head, push up and through. So I'm gonna come back to you, behind the head, squeeze the back of the arm. You have 15 left to go. So remember to breathe, keep your middle locked nice and tight. Good, good. Can you give me 10 more? Are you feeling it on the back of your arms right now? You've got 10 left. Nine. If you have a slightly bulky handbag, you might need to take some bulky items out, just so it doesn't keep tapping on the back of the head. You've got five more to go. Give me four. Three. Two. Just one more. And relax, that's the back of the arms done. Give them a little shake, give them a little relax. If you need to, pop the bag down. We're gonna move on to working the thighs and the bottom. So we're gonna move into a lunge position. Feet are hip width, come into the lunge. Imagine you're in a shopping center, you've seen the shoes you want. You're gonna grab those shoes and then you're gonna pull it away just so no one else can get them. Are you ready? You've got 10 each side. So you're gonna come down, pull back, down, Pull back. Good, good. Can you give me five more on this side? You've got five. Give me four. Three. Two. Nearly there. And one. And relax, change sides. This time it's a handbag that you want. Are you ready? So, reaching forward. Lunge back, pull. Through. Pull, good. Got eight left. 
seven, six, five, you need it, four, three, your legs should definitely feel warmer now, two, last one, and relax. Okay, very last exercise we're going to think of is going to be involving the upper body, also the outer thigh. So I'd like you to take your feet wider than hip width. You're going to start from one side. As you lift, arm goes up, leg goes out. Are you ready? Again, if you're anywhere near the cat or the sofa, just be careful. Are you ready? You've got 10, 9, 8. How's it feeling? Seven, six, five, I'm definitely starting to feel it in the outer thigh, four, three, two, one. Well done. Change sides for me. Feel a little bit wider. So you're going to lean over to one side. Again, make sure there's nothing over that side of the room. Are you ready? Leaning over. Lift. Good stuff. You've got ten left. Nine. Eight. We nearly there. Seven. How are the thighs feeling? Okay. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one. And relax. I think that's all your exercise is done. <laughs> so there you go, guys. There's your handbag workout. Now, how many of you were thinking at the start of this that this was a little bit silly, a little bit of a joke? But you know what? This is the four kilogram version that we're working with here. So, Jackie, am I right? There's a bit of workout going there on. There is definitely a bit of working out going on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, get yourself some weight, four kilos round about right, and um, Give us a little bit of a handbag workout. Alrighty, have some fun.